All right, you guys, so in today's video, I wanted to start off a little bit differently. I ended the last vlog with the military ball. We were at the shop at on our way home to our babies. And this vlog, I wanted to start off with uh, our Friday day off. So Amelia didn't have school and Zachary did not have work. So we decided to just have a girls day and a uh, boys guys day. <laughs> so the boys are going to be going out and about with um, daddy and then we are going to be home. I started off with painting Amelia's nails. As you see, Lydia was there with us and she was in her crib. She's starting to roll over now. I'm going to try to get some footage of that. But um, yeah, I wanted to start this vlog off to share with you guys um, what we're doing today. Today is pretty chill um, and this is our weekly vlog for you guys. So today again is a Friday for us um, but it's our Friday day. We started off with um, a late lunch. We all woke up on our own time <laughs> this morning which was nice. So yeah here we go and I hope you guys enjoy. Are you ready for to go with daddy today? Mm -hmm. But then we ain't going. No Jeffrey's not going. It's just you and Jacob mm -hmm. going with daddy. Hope you have fun. Y'all have fun with daddy, okay? It was right on the This day that God has given me, I'm not gonna waste this joy deep down inside me. I'm not gonna shake. Been stressed for so long, so stuck in my own way. So I'm gonna enjoy this moment. It's the day that the Lord has made. It's literally 3:30 in the morning. I'm just now finishing my hair. I don't even want to say nothing else other than that. And I'll see you in the morning. And I pray that my hair lasts like this for at least three to six weeks. <laughs> I'll see you guys in a little bit catch in the morning or it might even be noon time by the time I wake up at 3 a.m. <laughs> Alright you guys my catch in a little bit. I'm gonna go upstairs, wrap my hair. Good night. Or good morning. Okay. Hey y'all. So I just want to do my hair really quick. I'm not gonna be long. You may hear I do mean what? <laughs> You may hear our dehumidifier in the back. I just want to join here real quick because we're getting ready to go to the commissary. You can come in here, but just. Um, and I want to show you guys what my hair looked like the day after I finished it. So I left off by sharing with you guys what my. I gotta brush your hair, I don't want to forget. Um, okay. I already said that. Yeah, I know. I'm just. Yeah, you're right. I just reminding myself looking at you before we leave. I need to brush your hair. Okay. All right. Let me talk, okay? Okay. So, I left off by sharing with you guys we were exercising this morning. So, today is Saturday morning. We are going to run some errands, commissary errands. I'm going to close out my commissary vlog. Someone asked me, or I'm sorry, I do have a commissary walkthrough that's almost complete. Someone asked me to make one. I made a walkthrough of the BX for Kadena Air Base. Um, in Okinawa, Japan, that's where we are. But I didn't make one for the commissary yet. So it's almost done. It's just taking me a little bit longer because it's a little bit harder, in my opinion, to get that kind of content discreetly going around the commissary. But um, hopefully you're gonna like it and it'll be helpful for everyone that's interested in what the commissary looks like on base um, at Kadena Air Base in Okinawa, Japan. So I wanted to jump in here real quickly all ultimately because you guys didn't see my hair so i did my hair all day yesterday i washed it the night before we can't no actually no i didn't i washed it yesterday morning um we went to the ball on thursday so friday i wa woke up washed my hair let it air dry then i parted my hair i did all that which took about an hour top so i was able to start that and finish it without any interruptions and then what took the longest was the crochet method of um, putting the hair in and then twisting it. That took all day and all night. Now I did have several interruptions, but I will say crocheting my hair 
um it was my first time doing it so that's why it took so long but if i had to guess i would say somewhere between 12 and 3 i started to crochet my hair i didn't finish until 3 a.m 3 30 a.m um and that is that video i share with you where i'm in the kitchen and i'm facing the stove light um because i was tired like but i knew i didn't want to wait any longer i didn't want to stop uh, and do it today because first of all we had plans and two like i'm the type of person if i can get something done i'm gonna get it done and i wanted to make sure i got my hair done so i can start fresh today with something totally new i would totally do it again i plan on doing it again obviously it's my first time and i still enjoyed the process it was just a very long process um there's things that you can always take away from your first time doing anything and so that's what exactly i'm that's exactly how I feel about it. Like I, I, me and my husband talked about it, you know, just the first time trying it out and seeing what I like about it, what I don't like it. And if I would even do it again and, um, I would do it again. Um, so I think I actually put a video in here a couple of vlogs ago about me meeting someone at the park that was a cosmetologist. So, um, I was going to send her a picture of me in this hair saying like, I actually was able to do it because she couldn't, um, she couldn't do it short notice, which is totally understandable. Uh, was a lot of, I was asking a lot of her. So, um, I, I'm going to let her know that I did do it. And if you watch that vlog, it was basically, basically me talking about, um, sitting down, uh, basically me talking about meeting someone like two days before um the ball that actually is specializes in like braids and um added hair like cro crochet she wasn't familiar with crochet but because she's a licensed cosmetologist when you know something you can just learn it it's easier for you to learn we are specialized in that area anyway i want to also update you guys on this diy i know nothing about crochets other than my mom did my first install about Four, three months ago, four months ago, because she came out when Olivia was just born. She installed my first crochet ever, which I loved it. I just feel like I'm more of a twist type person versus like wearing the hair out. I know, sorry. Um, so yeah, <laughs> we're gonna go, we're gonna go. So we'll see you guys in a little bit and we'll catch you later, bye. Here we go. Thin mints, getting ready for the thin mints. Thin mints. All right, y'all ready? Hey, Jacob, Jeffrey. Everybody's getting one, okay? You get a thin mint. You get a thin mint. You get a thin mint. Me get a thin mint. We all get thin mints. Say thank you to the Girl Scout. Thank you to the Girl Better. You got nothing left. What is it, Mr. Scott?